Hey, it's Iron Gone, and welcome back to my Warlords of Draenor playthrough. Uh, last time we left off, we rushed back to get some quests turned in before our experience potion expired. Um, I ran back and did a bunch of garrison quests. Um, figured I've shown you enough of that that I don't need to show it to you every time. Uh, but while I'm here, we have a, a quest to go to Ashran, and I heard that's something to do with more garrison stuff. So we're going to fly over there and just see what's going on, because I really have no idea what's, uh, what's happening. Also, I turned the music up a little bit in-game so that we can have a little bit of background music. I don't know how well it's going to come out as opposed to all the other sound, but I thought, you know, just throw it out there. So, this these freaking wyverns are cool looking. Uh, I guess they're like, like saber tooth version, like they're old school versions. I don't know. They have little uh, scorpion tails too, which is kind of whack. They're like rams, horns, saber tooth tiger heads, or lions, I guess. Tattered bat wings, and then scorpion tail. Very interesting. Alright, so we are flying to Ashran, which is across like all sorts of terrain. So hopefully, uh, we get a nice little uh, flyover. We've already been through this zone, obviously. Um, Frostfire Ridge. We fought our way through here, killed some slimes. And uh, currently we've been questing in the zone coming up here. We've seen most of that. That's a cool little uh, doodad there. S giant uh, uh, Cyclops skull. That's pretty cool. Um, I, I kind of wish that uh, you could put the view distance farther, but there are some limitations in the game, I guess. So, Ooh, getting a little bright there. Randomly just blind, blinding uh, light coming in. Oh man, so the, uh, yeah, we got a little bit of PvP in on the last episode, which was fun. i really like to do more of that. Um, we just gotta jump on, jump into the fights when we see them, right? Um, other than that, there's not a ton we can do. Alright, so, looks like we're gonna fly a little bit over the Tanan jungle, which is level 100 zone. So, we won't actually be going here for some time, but I guess we'll get to fly by it and kind of see the lighting and the sky and stuff. This is uh, Hellfire Peninsula, if you uh, played Burning Crusade. This is where Hellfire Peninsula was. And this is where our, uh, the escape from the the Black Portal was at the beginning. So, looks like we're not going to get to see much of it, though. So, yeah, whatever. Yeah, the, uh, the storms, the winds, and the craziness has passed. Don't have... Uh, it's snowing right now, of course. It's Canada snowing um but uh it's not as bad as it was so things are good internet stable power is stable so far they really did a lot to improve the water in the last couple expansions in this this game it used to be very very bad it's not great now it's not the best water i've ever seen but it's better than nothing so ashran i think is the pv outdoor pvp island so I think this is going to be our area. This is the Alliance area, and they kind of fight over it every once in a while. I don't know how it works, but while we're here, let's check it out. I mean, why not? Maybe I'll make this like a PvP episode if we can get in on that. Um, I am about to ding uh, level 95. You'll note that between last episode and now, I've gained about 10% of the experience. That's because some of the garrison quests are giving me chunks of experience, so... I'll try not to level up off screen, but uh, I will have money, slight Brad. experience changes there. So, upgrades in Ashran. Okay. Keep it real. So he's just gonna sell me hey, stuff. Oh, so he sells using comprehensive outpost construction guides, which we have one of. Outpost building assembly notes. Oh, we can buy level two stuff. Garrison blueprints. Those post building assembly notes. Yeah, those are the ones we need. Lumber mill level two. Got her sanctum level two. Trading post level two. What is that? Oh, requires salvage yard. Alchemy lab, enchanter study, boutique, engineering works. Allows the followers of the engineering trait to work here, granting a unique bonus. Also allows up to 14 more groups at a time. Hmm. Hmm. Enables access to your guild bank. Again, hmm. I'm not sure which one of these I'm going to buy yet. 
but uh, there's a training post level 2 here. Oh. Grants the access to the Shatari Defense or Laughing Skull factions. Also unlocks the ability to acquire parts from around Draenor to build an, uh, an auctioneer. Yeah, I think I'm going to buy that. I'm just going to go for it. Trading post level 2. That sounds interesting. New factions to level up. I'm not... I have no problem with that. Um, okay, sweet. I'll buy it. And we'll learn it. Be good. Ding. Okay, great. Um, and this guy. What brings you here? Okay, he's gonna want. He's gonna give us the actual PvP quest, I think. There was a lot of people out here, and they're mostly max level, so this is probably like an end game area. Well, pretty obviously, it's like a end game PvP area. Uh, pleased to finally meet you in person. I hope you will find our facilities up to be up to your high standards. This inn is run by Naren Donglo. In my opinion, this is the best place to hearth in Draenor. We have new recruits coming through the portal daily. In fact, one of our latest recruits, Zar Jin, just came through the portal today. Cool. Alright. Um, hmm. I'm not going to set my hearthstone here yet. Oh, are there guards? Oh, is this also... Ashran is also our, like, main, like... This is our town, too, like, our main faction hub. So they turned the PvP zone into also the main faction hub for the area? Hmm. Oh, I don't know if that's a good idea or a bad idea. Alright, let's talk to her. Alright, fine, I'll make it our home. If it's got everything I need, then it's gonna be the home, so, whatever. Um, alright... That cool mount that I want. But might not be able to get, depending on how quickly we get to max level. There's somebody threw down Jeeves. Looks like Iron Gods arrived to help crack some Alliance Skulls. Yeah. What are these? Portal to Ogremar. Oh, cool. Talk to me. Mm-hmm. Later. So he's happy to see me. Void storage, okay. What can I do for you? You don't have anything to say? Greetings. Nope. Portal trainer. Bet you my mage can learn how to make a portal here, which would be nice. Uh, let's see. What else we got? What else we got, guys? This place is pretty hopping. This place is cool. Um, in this building. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun, dun. I'm very tempted today, by the way. I was very tempted to buy, uh... To buy Dragon Age Inquisition. But, uh, I don't know if I should, or if I should go and buy the, um... Or Dragon Age Origins and play it from the start, or, or what I should do. But, uh, it's on my mind right now. I don't know what, what I'm gonna do there. So, Quartermaster, what does she got? Permanent Frost Essence. That's a toy. Um, cool. A mount. Contract. That's a follower. A sweet level 95 trinket. Cool. Huh. Well, that's interesting, but nothing I need. Steam Weedle Quartermaster. Even more stuff. Great. Um, Arcoa's stuff, cool. This is like a faction hub. Banker, banker, banker. Okay, well, whatever. Let's go back and turn this quest in. Let's see where we go from there. I have no idea how this area works, but, uh, it's pretty crowded, so I assume this is going to be kind of our, aside from our actual garrison, this is going to be kind of our, our place to be, I think, so... Um, yep. There's something you should meet. You want to set your stuff on fire, but at least best mage is Simon Draenor. Vivian. Okay. She set my stuff on fire? I don't recall that, actually. Probably from previous quests that I did not do. Greetings. 
Traveling tra Oh, that's uh, from somebody's mount. Holy crap. Is this the auction house? Yeah, the auctioneer's inside the thing. That's weird. Uh, I kind of like the zone. It's it's not great. It's not bad, though. Oh, here's the undead section, of course. Herbalism, trainer, portal to Undercity. Oh, are there portals to all the major cities here? Yes. Sylvana sent me to find you. Beware the oh. Cool. Our time. Sweet. Achievement and epic fire mage. Sweet. That brings us to 10 followers. Not too shabby. Uh, let me just do a quick quick loop around. I just want to see if there's anything else here worth mentioning. This looks like Goblin Town. Yeah. Engineering plans. Same idea. This is the same stuff that you'd see uh, pretty much anywhere. Um, I haven't figured out how to do archaeology yet either, which is something that I'm really interested in. Uh, dun dummies, dummies. War Spear Shadow Hunters, Inscription Trainer. Should go talk to the Inscription Trainer. Have I got the... Hello, man. Oh. Stay away. Do I have the max level Inscription yeah. stuff? The Solace. Ah, your Starfall is now replaced with Sunfall, and your Hurricane is now replaced with Astral Storm. That's cool. Okay, I already know that. So these take Secret of Draenor inscriptions. I need herbs for that. I don't have any herbs. Uh, I can't wait till I get my herb garden. It's going to make things much better. Okay. All right. Those are cool mounts. Let's uh, let's just get out of here, I guess, for now. Unless I can do something in this area, but I don't think I can. I'm going to just go run over and take a look. Oh, who's this? Oh. Cool birdie guys. Well, I'm just a birdie too. Alright, let's just go look over here real quick. See what the hell's going on. Why not, right guys? Why not? we got time. Do, 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 do. Am I going to get murdered? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I'm too low level to do battle on Ashran. Well then. Learn my lesson. Guess I'm getting out of here, guys. I'll be back. We're going to run over to... Uh, Flightmaster. Go back to where we were. Knock out some more quests. I can also queue up for some dungeons. Um, so I think we want to go to Beast Watch again. Stay away from the voodoo. Oh, or I could have... Should have hearthed my garrison and started building that second level of uh, crap. Oh, well, I'll take care of that later. It's not like it's uh, urgent anyway. Second level of the trading post. Eh. Take care of that after we uh, we ding 95. Because we'll probably have a quest then to do like the herb garden or something at that point anyway. So do that all at once. So Knock some quests out. And uh, see if we can get finished uh, Gorgron. Because I think we're almost done. Uh, let's go achievements. Um, quests, Draenor, those are bonus objectives, eh. Oh, I have finished the Gorgon storylines, and I don't think you care to watch me grind all these bonus objectives, so we may actually be headed to Talador, Should, uh, which means I think I do have to go back to, because uh, there was a flight thing, there was a quest, yeah. So what we'll do is, um, we've done all the story quests, so I'm going to say, ah, screw those for now. I will probably knock these out at some other point uh, to get the achievement, because I'm a completionist. But I don't think you guys want to watch me grind all the stupid things anyway. Because, um, geez, there's a lot in this area. Not to mention whatever the heck's up here. I don't know, maybe that's Alliance stuff. I'm not sure, really. Either way. We're going to land. I'm going to hearth back to Frostfire. I'm going to build the thing. 
and then we're going to jump over to uh, Taldor and see what's in the new zone. Because, yeah, I don't see uh, any problems with that. It seems pretty good to me. We can check it out, get our first quest, and kind of get an introduction to the zone. Um, so sweet, we get to see Ashran and Taldor in one episode. Can't complain about that. Um, silly freaking wyvern. They just look weird. All right. I just crit. I just crit my pants. He says. Okay. So while I'm here, though, I'm gonna drop quests. Uh, we're gonna go abandon. Abandon. Hmm. Yeah. No. No one cares. We'll come back someday. All right. Hearth. Because we're screw flying. It's too too hard to fly. Bam. I'm really excited for my uh, for my herb garden because currently I have uh, the mine and it's upgraded to level two. But that mine is sweet. I get more than enough reagents to uh, do my daily or whatever every day. So don't mind that at all. Uh, Vivian, we're gonna send you on this. Take that out. All right, architect. So trading post upgrade three hundred and three hundred. Takes one hour. Perfect. Frostwall Tavern, where do you go? Oh, uh, same spot. We need uh we need to level up our uh, our garrison for sure. But that's a wa a ways off, so I'm not gonna worry about that too much. Um what else do I need to do here? Do that thing and then just fly. Yep. Okay. How may I aid you? Take me to my base in Taldor. Bye. Bam! Off we go on a look at that. Look at that. Normal looking windrider, guys. Is that is that not a lot better? Well actually no. Lower res, but, you know, these guys have been around since vanilla. What, can you blame them? They still have a scorpion tail, but it's just like, I guess I never really noticed it, because it's lower res, so it looks more shitty, I guess. Whatever. I like him. He's cool. He's a cool little guy. Ooh, listen to that music. Oh, I really like the music in this game. Of course, you gotta like the music in every game for Warcraft, right? I mean, it's it's pretty amazing. Um, and here we are flying over Zanger Marsh, also known as Zanger Sea. Apparently, mushrooms like to grow in the water in these lands. So there's Gorgon again. Except I never was down here. I don't think. Hmm. Ooh, here we go. The color, the colors in this zone are nice, kind of like an an autumny feel. Does remind me of uh, of the zone in Burning Crusade, which I forget the name of right now. Ah, uh, crap. Terracar Forest, in the green parts anyway. Do the bone? Oh, so the bone wastes will be like probably a happy green area. Ah, oh, looks like we're going to have another outpost. Oh, yes. Can I salute back? There we go. Sweet. And who's here? <laughs> Morketh Blade Howl. Nope. Not letting you out. <laughs> I see uh, my men are hard to work here. Speak, friend. For the ah, he's gonna... Strength. He is going to ask me to build one thing or another, I'm sure. There's the drafting table. All right. Do we want Vol'jin's arsenal? Provide higher quality weapons and armor for your troops. Which also allows the use of artillery strike. Cool. Huh. Arcane Sanctum will transform some of your forces into powerful spellcasters. Guardian orb. Huh. Oh, boy. Vol'jin's arsenal sounds really sweet. But wizardry sounds sweet, too. I'm going to go with wizard, like the wizardry this time, because I've heard someone say the Vol'jin's arsenal is really sweet, but I want to see what the Arcane Sanctum does. So I'm pretty sure we can switch these down the road. There we go. Nice. 
Pride Magus, eh? Oh, Lord. Hmm. Okay, cool. Rotar. Go forth to victory. Uh, one detail. Don't forget to connect the sanctum to the laid line network. Now everybody, listen up. Thanks to our commander, Insane. we got a new building up. Now we gotta get this new structure up to snuff pronto, all right? <laughs> get to it. Yes. Get to it yesterday. You won't be needing me. You're in charge after all. Freaking Gazlo. He's just gonna go drink, isn't he? Yep. Alright. Speak to Archmage so and so in Teltor. He's that way. It's not a problem. Any other quests in the area? Nope. Innkeeper, not interested. Explosives? Oh, schematics. Oh, these are like low level schematics. Adamantite bar, golden dranite. Yeah. Huh. Those are really old school. That takes me back. Okay, so, um. Grab the flight point. Did I do that yet? I think I already did. And then we gotta head to the east. So, as soon as I get to Vol'jin, I'm gonna pop my experience potion. And then we'll have lots of time to, uh. Knock this out. This zone is going to be pretty good. Uh, I'm getting a little tired of all the trees, but it's a little bit more open than the jungle. Okay. Very well. I'll meet you there. Stay safe. Poof. Except her weapon was left behind. Uh, let's see. It's nice to see someone else taking a vested interest in the arcane arts, you know? It's all too rare these days, if you ask me. Unfortunately, I must e I must meet Cordana to handle an important matter, but we're in luck. One of my good friends in the Kirin Tor has agreed to help you connect your arcane sanctum to the Ley Line Network. He's waiting at my tower. Let's leave immediately and introduce you to one another. You gonna teleport me? Come, so I will introduce you to a friend of mine who can help you with your tower. Okay. Oh. Uh, alright, alright, all right. Don't leave without me. Ooh, that was a weird spike. Uh. Let us pass, gatekeeper. Lady Proudmoore has expressly <laughs> forbid Horde from entering Karen Tor ground. Then let Jaina take it up with me. I am a member of the council, and you will let me and my friend pass. Ooh, what do you gotta say about that? My tower lies just through this pass. Hmm. Oh crap! <laughs> don't don't make eye contact. Don't make eye contact. It's higher level than us. Bone fishing pole. Oh, sweet. Your tower. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh. Got it. When you are ready, take this portal down to my tower. Hold on, just get in the flight path. I'm ready. I'm ready now. Whoa. <laughs> My friend is just ahead. Okay. Cool story. Frost is clear of the superior path. Give up. We'll see about that. You gonna talk? Ah, there you are. This is the one I was telling you about. Magister Splendid. Cross. I can take things from here. Very good. I'm sure I'll be seeing the both of you soon. Oh god. <laughs> he turned into a mount. Alright, see you later, Archmage Kedgar. Our enemies will fall. Alright, these are all quests that are actually worth yeah. Keep your wits about you. This is where I'm gonna pop my thing, because the these are the quests that are actually uh worth some experience. We will have justice. Let's but burn it up. 
Oh, he's coming with me. That's cool. All right. Um, we're going to go down here. Yep, looks like we are. Uh, what's the easiest way down there? And experience potion. Getting popped. Eh, we'll just pop it now. We're getting there. Perhaps we can use these energized mushrooms to our advantage. Uh, okay. Nature resistance increased by 100. Nature resistance? I didn't think they had that in the game anymore. That's pretty slick. Alright. So we gotta kill these things. He actually jumped with me when I did my charge. That's cool. Never thought he would be able to do that. Alright. Yeah, do some damage. Sweet. Oh, did he just... Yeah, he did sheep one of them. How nice. How nice of him to sheep something for me. Um... Let's see. Uh... Covered in pulses. Gather enough the oil. Okay, well, they didn't drop any, so... Crap. Pop this... Not expecting the arcane energy to be this potent. Potent. This potent. He's just nuking them, I think, from behind the stupid tree. And there's the level. We get anything from that? Nothing. Nothing. Oh well. Level 95, gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, there's some pulsing uh, pustules. Yum. Slumbling, slumbering protectors. Pretty much. Hmm. Oh, right here, in front of me. Don't wake up. Don't wake up. It's odd that these ancient protectors never awaken despite all this mess. Yeah, it's because they're sleepy. It's not really their fault. Doof, doof, doof. That's one down. And two down. That's a goodly amount. Ooh, arcane vortex. Here we go. We're matter. We're we're motoring along here. We'll have these quests done in no time. Is that? Oh, he's putting something weird on the ground. If I had herbalism, I could herbalize these guys. Ooh, I see my favorite thing. Like a rare up there. I wonder how you get up there. I'll have to check that out at some point. Across the mushroom, maybe? Maybe. Let's go up the slope here. This is obviously a path, so let me run up it. Um, yeah, how did he get over there? I saw a guy over there on my map, so... Another arcane vortex. I'll turn that quest in. Business. Farewell. And... There's a path over there. Where was it? I lost it. Crap. Just looking at it. There was a path over here that I want to 
Investigate. Oh, I don't know where it goes. Maybe it doesn't exist. Oh, oh he's over this way. Alright. Sorry about that, guys. I'm trying to find out where this guy is. He might just be down. Yeah, he might just be down here. Okay, that makes it easier. I think. There he is. He's got a bit of help, but that's nothing. Somebody here to help out anyway, so... <laughs> ah, sucker! These things are also from Burning Crusade. They're reusing a lot of their assets, but... Ah. As long as there's a good variety in, a, in areas, I don't mind. If it makes sense. A brain. Uh, another trinket? Oh, God. How many trinkets are you going to give me? How many trinkets, guys? When your spells deal critical damage, you have a chance to gain 401 intellect. Oh, great. I really need that. Whatever. I'm assuming it's also part of an achievement at some point, so... That's one of the reasons why I'm doing it, but... I'm gonna kill this guy. Eat War Stomp! Boom! I'm gonna finish these quests up, guys, and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna... Um, I'm erring on the side of... Uh, Nobody really said they liked the longer episodes, so I'm erring on the side of moderate length episodes and just getting them out quicker. Um, recording them quicker and rendering them quicker. I updated to a newer version of uh, Sony Vegas, finally, I stopped being lazy, so um, I am able to use GPU rendering, which is, you know, good. Makes things faster. Um, and then I'm going to be recording, I tried to record Starbound the other night and lost some of the, the audio, so I'm just going to redo the first bit um let me know if you want to meet if you want to see dragon age i mean obviously at this point it's not like a brand new game um but let me know Ooh, i saw an alliance there um dragon age origins um or if you just want me to jump right into the dragon age inquisition i have played origins a small amount but i've not played number two and i've obviously not played inquisition however if people are interested in seeing me do a playthrough of either one, I will definitely uh, do it. It's something that I want to do. Um, okay, I need to find one more slumbering protector. I assume he's over here. While I'm doing it. Yeah, let's look. Let's just look everywhere. There he is. Okay, and I just got to kill a couple guys and get their stupid pulsating pustules. And yeah, I will be playing Far Cry 4 whenever it goes on sale. I'm not really interested in buying it full price, um, but it looks good. I was convinced from what I saw that I liked the characters enough. Um, the bad guy in particular, the antagonist, that uh, I want to I wanna check it out. But I'm not really one who necessarily needs to jump into AAA titles, uh, brand, like brand new titles right away. Um, I'm more of the, uh, let's catch up on old. Since I don't play nonstop, um, and games like WoW take up a lot of my time, I don't really have, I'm not really current on a lot of games. For example, I played Mass Effect 1, and I played a little bit of Mass Effect 2, and then have, I've, I own Mass Effect 3, but I never played the story. So I would be interested in doing an entire playthrough of that as well. Things like that. I'd like to have one good story game going on, like um, WoW, or uh, it's kind of funny to consider WoW a story game, or a Bioware game, something like that. And then also have like um, some Starbound or some Minecraft or something going on at the same time. You know, something that I don't really have to pay as much attention to in terms of reading things or uh, you know, just pr it's not as much. It's a uh, as I want instead of till the end kind of progression so <laughs> Swotor is a good game too Star, uh, Star Wars Old Republic good MMO I would I would play through the story on that again I have before it's free to play too so 
Uh, as long as it's not too grindy, I wouldn't mind seeing the story. Uh, that guy is falling through the world. Oh, he's fixed himself. Don't pay any attention to that. Oh, I still am short one, so let's just jump on him. You fell through the world one time too many. Oh no, big guy aggroed. How will I ever survive? Maybe by kicking ass. Alright. Time to die. Alright, more than enough. Glory to the Sindorai. We will I will go to your outpost to make the scroll. Okay. Meet me there when you can. Okay. Hmm. I'm just gonna take a quick peek. See what else is going on here, if anything. Let me get out of here. Arcane investigations. Pleased to meet you. Hmm. Any oddities? He'd be interested in examining them. Okay. Mailbox. Nothing really going on there. Innkeeper. I don't know why you would buy, ever bind here. I mean, I understand, I guess, that... Maybe... Zangra. This is kind of like Zangra Marsh. It's kind of the same idea. But, whatever. Repairs. Hey there. Hey there. See you around. Classic WoW voice. Hey there. Can't take a taxi while shapeshifted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm familiar with that error. Seen it a few times. <sighs> it was really bad back in, like, Burning Crusade. You couldn't do anything while shapeshifted. Now, most of the time, it'll shapeshift you f for you. Since I get so used to being in cat form, I don't even realize. Right? So... Alright, let's take the lazy man path. You need something? Have a good one. Pfft, 88 silver? Nothing. Um. Oh, okay. I was like, you're not flying the right direction, guy. Up and over! I'd also say there's their world design has gotten a lot better. Like, they understand now that they have to design areas with flying mounts in mind ahead of time. <clears throat> Excuse me. Vanilla WoW had all sorts of oddities because they'd never intended to have flying mounts at the start of the game. Hmm. Most of you won't know this. Well, some of you won't know this, but there were no Keep flying mounts at all. Locked. We're going to be teleporting straight into hell. What? Okay. Uh, the dark mounts dark didn't exist at all, but they introduced them. The at the base of the fortress. Okay, we gotta go to a fort fortress now. Oh, there's a lot of quests all of a sudden. What can I help you with? May your okay, five stacks of supplies, five garrison records. Wanted honor. quests. Sweet. Strength. Pick these up. Woo! How you doing, Speak to Duratan. Okay. All right. There's a lot of crap going on. Uh, which quest is right here? Whoops. Oh. So it's a bird that flies around the area. Okay. Interesting. Oh. Wandering Vindicator. Let's go over here. I don't know what this is, but Wandering Vindicator, Wandering Vindicator. Stack of supplies. What's a Wandering Vindicator about? Rare. Alright. Take you down. Fly I've seen your kind before flying among the mountains to the south. Why have you come here? Uh. Cuz. To the south? Okay. I don't know. Oh, you sound very, very upset. Unfortunately for you, you are dead. Oh, no, not dead. I see. Uh, 
Okay. Forgotten Vindicator's Blade. Wow. Unmarked journal. Okay. An Arakoa sun priestess has come to our home seeking dominion over our lands. She brings dust and wind and death, scorching our fields with sunfire. There are a few pages missing. Our village bleeds slowly to death. Many of our defenders have fallen under an abominable curse, which we call the sun sickness. They return to our village, stumbling and dazed, and unable to feel the warmth of the light. Today I saw the sun priestess in the woods near our village. I was barely able to escape, but not be cast the sun sickness upon me. Since she uttered her foul incantation, I have tried playing, praying to the light and felt nothing. Where there once was everlasting divinity, now I sense only emptiness. Never has I felt, have I felt such terror. Um, I have sent the children, the sick, and the elderly away. May they find safety beyond the river, away from here. Only I remain. I will slay the sun priestess today. Most of the mage remaining pages are gone, except for the last entry. Much time has passed since I slew the feathered witch. How many seasons, how many years, I have lost count. I am an old man, and my time is near. All these years I have wandered, blind and alone, serving... Se Severed from the light. What is a vindicator without vindication? It is to eat without tasting. It is to learn without understanding. It is to live without meaning. The darkness beckons. The world grows dim without the light. I am hopeless. So the reason... He cast that one ability. I'm fighting him again. Because reasons. And he, uh... Light of truth. Yeah. Blind re recom set recompense. He's like... Just kind of casting. He's not really... Uh... He can't really feel it, he's just kind of doing it, if that makes sense. Alright, let's, let's take care of this guy. Yeah, I don't care what kind of healing you've got on you. You ain't tough enough for me. Mm. So that refreshes my rip. So I gotta remember to put rip up and then smash him with ferocious bite because it uh, it refreshes the duration of rip if they're at low health. Makes sense. And uh, I'm gonna move away so I don't get attacked again because there's a guy down here. Oh, he died. But uh, strength, stamina, haste, mastery. Eh an okay weapon I suppose excuse me uh, steel tusk I'm gonna wait here for steel tusk real quick guys and then uh, I think I'm just gonna cut the episode after I murder this guy I think maybe or actually you know what I'll just end it now and then uh, I'll jump in uh, next episode okay guys all right so while we wait you guys make sure to leave a comment like subscribe and once again this is iron gone Take care, guys.